Okay, Mike, I was going to say that, I better not say it. Anyway, um, today we're going to do like a juicing film. Uh, Darcy's still with me, right? Yes, I'm still here at Arnold's. <laughs> and uh, I guess the key point is, uh, in my mind, juicing is one of the highest forms of healing. And uh, a lot of times, in my opinion, most people don't do it the right way. I kind of, kind of review my opinion what's the right way. I would say my opinion, of course. Uh, I don't want you to believe a word I say. Key fact is everything's based on love. Every moment is based on love. That means our body understands that English. Understand the English of uh, love, understand what's good for it, what's bad for it. There's either truth or lie. So what Darcy's going to do is make a, um, a juice. Certain things I question because it's not based on love, and I guess I'll be good right now. There's a lot of theory out there, and everyone's right. In my mind, what's right is it has to be yummy to the tummy, which means it has to be raw, fresh, uh, yummy to the tummy. Raw, fresh, well, actually, it has to be grown in nature, found a tree bush or vine, it has to be yummy to the tummy. If it's not yummy to, tummy, yummy to the tummy in a raw state, don't eat it. Which means I would not recommend cayenne. You don't have to buzz in. <laughs> <laughs> got a buzz in. <laughs> what the heck is that about? I do not recommend that. Not I do not recommend. Well, I mean, a lot of people, a lot of people recommend it, but I don't. I don't recommend ginger, and I don't recommend garlic, because none of that's yummy to the tummy. On that note, do you have on that, that note, I'm sure there's a lot of disagreements out there with me. I'm sure everyone has an opinion, and everyone's right. I base mine on love. Every moment has been loving, loving, and a body, in my mind, infinite wisdom, does not want to eat this in large quantity, does not want to eat uh, cayenne in large quantity, and, well, this is cayenne, does not want to eat garlic in a large quantity. Actually, garlic has something called polysanate, which affects the production of thyroxin, which in turn makes you tired. A woman comes to my store, very tired, veg and a vegetarian, the very first question I ask her is, uh, does she eat garlic? Okay, on that note, this is a... Uh, Let's put some garlic in cayenne. <laughs> I'll turn my uh, show over to... Uh, Dorothy. Dorothy. <laughs> uh, stage three. Good. Okay. Do you want to talk about your juicer or no? Oh, this is my angel, my super angel it's called. Um, I just got it as a Christmas present early. Um, you can go to angel.com. It comes from Korea. And I love it. And... How fast is it, by the way? How fast is it? Yeah. We'll see, won't we? Yeah. Um, can, I just, one? can I just go like this on the name? Where's the name? Does the name angel? is right here. Angel. My it's daughter's an angel name is brand. Angel. That okay. helped in the process. Hey, Timmy. So. Actually, it's one, the, of the, it's actually one of the best juices out there. Yes. Which means uh, what Dorothy wants to do also is uh, create a business from juicing. And uh, right now she's in the beginning stages of that. Yeah. Kale is fun. It zips it right up. Wow. That's that's awesome. Yes. Fine. Sometimes it needs a little extra help. You need a plunger? I have one actually. Let's see. And what are you what are you making by the way? I am making what's called wake up juice. Wake up juice. For the first juice in the morning. Okay. And why is it wake up? I guess the cayenne pepper. The cayenne pepper. Kind of wakes you up. Kind of wakes you up, okay. And you like cayenne, by the way? I do. It kind of gives it a kick. I right. like spicy, so. Right. I actually love cayenne pepper. You love cayenne. Right? In just a small quantity. As of today. No, I've always loved cayenne right. pepper. As of right now. Yeah. I only use it very moderate. Yeah. So you have kale? We have kale. No, no, it was leaving a message. I just forgot to turn it off. And how many juice how many how many juices do you have in the morning? I mean, I'm sure that Six six different juices for the day. Totaling ninety-six ounces for my juice feast. Right. For the week. Right. And you drink uh this in the morning? I am. So and right now you make your juice right now for the morning? Yes. And let's see, the next thing we have for the cucumber, I just 
cut it in half. By the way, this is uh, this is really dry. Yeah. It's most. Wow. Yeah. Oh my God, <laughs> that is like, like it's like, feels like dust. Feels like dust is right. Yeah. That's Consumed amazing. It. Yeah. And then the cucumber. Oh my God, smell it. It smells like what? It's amazing, and you can see how fast it's coming out the bottom. But no, I don't smell it. Excuse me. Again. This is all video. No more. <laughs> I don't. Good. If I did, I wouldn't do other things. It's on video! Sorry. I can edit this, you can't. I never can edit it. Now we're doing next? Next week. So how many ounces does this make total? Make quite sure. a bit. Look at that. From right. those greens, it makes quite a bit of juice. Yeah. I've never really yes, measured it. Yes, it seems to be very effective. Right. And I like to take the seeds out of the apple right. mm -hmm. because there's actually arsenic in apple seeds that Oh, burned. wow. So. Let me just do a quick theory, my theory about seeds. Ready, Michelle? Okay. okay. This is my theory on mm -hmm. seeds based mm -hmm. on the Tanakh, which is basically the Hebrew uh, version of... Uh, of, um, they do like a uh, analysis of the Bible, uh -huh. and they what they said, according to Tanakh, is that if, if a seed falls out of your hand, mm. you should not eat it. Mm. If it slips out, mm -hmm. we should only eat seeds that we that stay in our hand. Oh. By theory, dead. Okay, next. No more seven minutes. That's seven minutes right there. Just uh, one second. Well, I want to stop, 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 stop. Oh. Right now, we went, I keep it to seven minutes, so I want to say goodbye. We say goodbye to Dorothy. Goodbye. Goodbye, Dorothy. safe to, to your fans? I love juicing. You love juicing? And what else do you want to do with it? You want to make a living from juicing? I want to make a living from juicing, helping other people love the juice as much as I do. Because you've seen results. I've seen results. I lost 13 pounds, which wasn't my goal. I just wanted to feel better. I lost 13 pounds my first week of juicing. In three months, I lost 27 pounds, and I'm... Focused and, you're, and happier right. than I've ever been in my life. And in my opinion, juice is, is the key, the key to go. I mean, the key way to go for the highest level of healing, other than water fasting. Anything else you want to say? That's it. You sure? Yeah. Okay, give me a hug. You may give me a hug. <laughs> Bye. 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 Take care.